Well, thank you. I'm gonna need your guys' help tonight. Knowing Nick, there's probably gonna be a Star Trek reference in here, and when we see that, I want you guys to just go crazy. Uh, so let's give it up. Ron, if you wanna start me, I'm gonna just tell you guys what I love, and hopefully <laughs> it's gonna be a good evening as we go. Uh, I love the internet. I love what's happening right now. Uh, tonight, Ignite, we are all here because of an open source movement. This idea started in San Francisco by a guy named Tim O'Reilly. It's ran by a bunch of interns. Here's an example of me and Nick giving a presentation at Laid Off Camp, another open source idea that started and is happening all around the world. We saw Ignite in Budapest right now, and all that it is is we're coming together around an idea. And the reason why these ideas are happening is because you're not watching TVs. So please, not only do you need to stop watching TV, stop reading the newspaper. Start diving into niche media. Internet is providing us to do so much. All of a sudden, the world is being so loud. We have to deal with cows. Everywhere we go, there's advertisements. Shut your eyes, shut your ears, and start tuning in. Tune into the world around you. Tune into the things that you want to love. We have this amazing word. We have our attention. One thing is coming and the world is changing. You're taking back your attention. You're taking it back where you look, where you listen, and where you go. Thank you for coming tonight. You're here not making out like these two people. You may be intellectually making out with some of the speakers tonight, and thank you. But it's all happening because... Things are changing, and things are changing in such a big way, the whole world is becoming unemployed. <laughs> and it's happening because the youngest people, we don't want a job. I heard it earlier tonight. I'm looking for a customer. So 70% of high schoolers want to start their own business? Absolutely. And I, I think there's high schoolers in here, and if you're in here, please raise your hand. You're our future. If not, there's a high schooler inside of each one of us. <laughs> Do something different. Do the thing you love. The internet is now giving us an opportunity. Forever how weird you are, forever how stoked you are about a simple, something simple, there's a hundred other people out there doing that same thing. There's people and communities that are talking about fat products. You don't have to stay at home and be alone anymore. When you can log on to the internet, you can find other people that are into the same things that you are. For instance, arranging boxes in a crazy world. <laughs> There's people out there, and through that, you can find your happiness. <laughs> That's really the special thing about the internet, is that you're not alone. And that this open source movement is happening in real life. They used to say, oh, Twitter's bad, Facebook is bad because you're sitting in front of your computer. But the environment is changing. The environment <laughs> is changing towards people coming out to celebrate, to get free beer at the start of the night, share ideas and spread ideas. Brian Swartz said it earlier tonight, the most important thing you can do is share an idea. Share what you learned tonight. So shop locally, support what you are learning tonight and interact with each other. If you've met someone here tonight who's a web designer, talk to them first. <laughs> you know, this is funny. So I actually have the city drug letters in my house. And the reason why I have those letters is because I walk the city streets of Fort Collins every single day, getting involved in my local community, getting out there, getting out away from my computer and doing the things that I love, smiling, walking and hanging out in this beautiful town of Fort Collins. We really have it good here. We have breweries, we have Ignite that's going on, we have laid off camp now, and all of a sudden, this community, people are respecting it. We're getting listed in magazines. People are saying Fort Collins is a place to live. And you know what? We're lucky because we already live here. <laughs> so keep living a great life. You know, we have this statue that's going to finally get out of Old Town. So <laughs> just another example of how another artist is expressing what they love. And then we're going to have a new artist down there. And it may or may not be great. But the most important thing is, is that they're doing what you love. And that's what the internet is giving us an opportunity to do. So if I walk out of here and you guys don't remember anything from the entire night, just remember to do what you love. <sighs> but really, <laughs> you got to remember that, you know, you're listening to a guy dressed up in a polyester suit and a bandana. 
You can learn from everyone. You've got to give yourself a chance to do that. So thank you guys for listening. Nick Armstrong's an incredible guy. Teaching classes on Tuesday nights. I'm Kevin Beecher. Thanks for coming out.